Ronaldo Romero has always dreamt of one thing, to play baseball in America. It passed through, through my mind, but I never think that it was going to happen. But it did, all thanks to more than a game. The nonprofit group has brought Romero to Phoenix City, where the Crawdads are giving him the chance to play baseball. Thank to God that I was looking for this and he gave me the opportunity and also more than again gave me the opportunity to bring me here and give everything I have. Romero was a pitcher for the Crawdads and is hoping to get a scholarship so he can attend college and play baseball, just like his friend Abelardo Paz, a teen also from Colombia who is currently playing at a community college in California. In my country, uh, the most important sport is soccer and almost anybody plays baseball there and just be here and play in the United States, play in summer ball is, is amazing. I think we've provided them an opportunity to, to live out a dream, a dream of playing collegiate baseball, a dream of playing at the next level and providing the Phoenix City Crawdads to phenomenal baseball players but most importantly to phenomenal human beings. Romero and Paz aren't the only ones who are living out a dream. Amari Telemaco Jr. is from the Dominican Republic. He's been brought to Phoenix City to enroll at Glenwood High School, where he'll be getting an education and playing baseball with the state championship Gators this spring. This is my first step, you know, to you know, grow, um, to be tough mentally, um, to be a best person. Telemaco Jr. has baseball in his blood. His father played in the major leagues from 1996 to 2005 and currently coaches baseball in the Dominican Republic. He's looking to continue the tradition his father set. He has been my role model, my, my role model, um, and that's all I want to do. To play a sport they all love, and they're doing it because of a nonprofit group that truly brings out the meaning of it being more than a game. Reporting from Phoenix City, I'm Jenna Caleri for WLTZ First News Sports.